Okay, so once again, good morning everyone. So our next topic for today is about co-creation and society. No? So that is social marketing. Uh, sige sir, uh, go ahead. Uh, good morning po. Uh, good morning, Dean. Good morning po, classmates. Uh, I'm the reporter of Chapter 19, Co-creation in so Society, Social Marketing. Uh, my name is Mark Samuel Fernandez and without so much further ado, let start now. Co-creation in society, uh, social marketing. Definition. Social marketing theory is a theory of mass communication that promotes socially valuable information and socially accepted behaviors. It tries to integrate marketing ideas, principles, tools, techniques, and socially beneficial concepts to promote communication and benefit society. The theory emerged in 1970s when marketing techniques were realized to sell ideas, attitudes, and behaviors rather than products and includes the concept of edutainment, education, and entertainment. The theory was proposed by Philip Kotler and Gerald Saltman, which is now being used by social and welfare organizations. Social marketing is not social media marketing. So, magkaiba po pala siya sa social media marketing. And, uh, concepts in social marketing theory. There are four concepts. Uh, social marketing theory is a framework that is help, helpful in planning, designing, implementing, and evaluating social campaigns with information sharing as its major objective. It uses creativity rather than depending on public service announcements. Like in the past, for giving out information, information is packaged and distributed following a plan so that maximum sharing and outcome is possible. Social marketing tries to understand social and psychological factors which bring resistance to change in society. It increases acceptability, response, and practice of any social idea for target group. Techniques of marketing like market segmentation, exchange theory, and consumer research are used extensively. Social intervention is the main objective of social marketing. There are two types of social marketing, operational social marketing and strategic social marketing. Operation social marketing is used to change behavior, whereas strategic social marketing is used to form new policies and development strategies. Components of social marketing. Number one, product. Target population is encouraged to buy or use socially needed products like family planning, cleaning drinking water, clean drinking water, saving, and credit organizations, nutritional foods, organic farming, etc. Sustainable products which benefit the society are the goal of social marketing. The product must have a place in the society. The product can be tangible like physical things or non-tangible like services and practices. Number one, product. Number two is price. Price in social marketing can be monetary or non-monetary. Monetary price is the price to buy the product which might help the population. Non-monetary price is the psychological or and social cost like changing a habit, time, or effort. If the price is minimum, the change is more profound. So number two, price. And number three, place. The place is where the target population in need can be found. It is where the social marketing will, the mo will be the most productive. It is the, product, it is the product distribution site where the implemented changes will take place or the place where the product is available. The campaign is successful if the place is easily accessible. Promotion, number four. The social marketing is done for the promotion of the product or habit. It is the way in which the information is provided. The tools and techniques used to make it effective are many, include, including advertisements, using charts, documentaries, etc., along with public relations, media advocacy, entertainment, etc. It takes creativity to promote in a better way. Uh, 
positioning is not sometimes taken as a component of social marketing, but is used as a technique. It is an image of anything that is created by the campaign. It is the social psychological aspect of the product which is promoted with the consumer needs, empirical evidences, and objective setting. Other components are public, partnership, policy, and etc. Public is the target audience as well as the stakeholders. Partnership between different similar agencies or communities also helps in social marketing. Similarly, change does not happen unless there is policy changes and other changes in administrative levels. Another component is the funds that is needed to conduct the whole process of social marketing. Major features of social marketing theory. There are also four. Social media network are applications that allow users to build personal websites, exchange personal. Uh, social media, according to Bowden and Lewis, can be characterized as online applications, platforms, and media which aim to facilitate interactions, collaborations, and sharing of content. Number one. Features of social marketing is target audience analysis and segmentation. A particular group of people which is in most need of particular product or awareness must be first analyzed to have a social change. The audience is analyzed in pre-production as well as production phase. Similarly, a group also has various subgroups that must also be analyzed by breaking them down which is known as audience segmentation. Existing community agencies must be used. The first step to social marketing is identifying the target population. Number two, create aware awareness. Though the social marketing is not effective sometimes to change behavior patterns of people, at least they provide awareness. People get to know the alternatives that they can adopt so that they are so that they are benefited in the future when different channels are used to create awareness people come to know about new things awareness is first the first step to change number 2 create awareness number 3 is increase interest by edutainment it is education and entertainment again the message in social marketing is creative and interesting. This way, the message is not forgotten for a long time easily. The message is reinforced repeatedly and the message is taken as credible by the target group. Education and entertainment is provided as package. People pay attention as well as get informed at the same time. For example, a street drama is not easily forgotten. Images are used to increase interest and get attention. Number four, desired results. The information should be so inter interesting and unforgettable that people do not take the social marketing process to be a learning process but as entertainment. When this kind of information reaches the intended target group, the third outcome is achieved as the message gets ingrained in the brain of the audience. Examples of social marketing theory. Social marketing is used for promoting tangible things like oral contraceptives or just non-tangible awareness like concept of family planning among a particular target group which is in need of social campaign. Other of social marketing done are oral rehydration, immunization, smoking health hazards, nutritious diet, Use of helmet in driving, slow driving, following traffic rules, use of phones while driving, HIV and drug use, cardiovascular disease, other communica communicable disease, sanitation, environment, pollution, corruption, etc. In U.S., national high blood pressure education programs and Stanford University used concepts of social marketing effectively in 1980s to show the risk of cardiovascular problems. Similarly, another example is Victoria Cancer Council of Australia using social marketing to conduct anti-tobacco campaign in 1988. Uh, last slide. 
Criticisms of social mar- marketing theory. Commercial marketing is sometimes done in the guise of social marketing. Yun. Uh, minsan, yung commercial marketing is nag-disguise as social marketing. And number two, being creative can sometimes cause problems as the audience have to interpret the message themselves and the message is not very assertive. Like, katulad nung kung may nakakaalala po sa inyo nung commercial ng RC Cola na tinanggal yung ulo nung tinanggal yung ulo nung nanay tapos ano pala siya isa pala siyang taong RC Cola isa yon na hindi yung social marketing is kahit gusto natin mag-engage pero yung message natin is not that very assertive mami-misinterpret ng tao and mahirap i-interpret ng audience and number three Social marketing theory is not taken as proper mass communication theory sometimes. So, that's all po, Dean and classmates. Thank you po. Okay, so you stay with your presentation. Okay. <clears throat> so, again, uh, don't forget what, that we define social media by its uh, interactivity, connectedness, and user-friendliness. No? Uh, user-generated content. So, in today's society, So the, the use of social media has become a necessary daily activity. <clears throat> so social media is typically used for social interaction and access to the news and information and decision making. So it is valuable communication tool with other locally and worldwide as well as to share, create, and spread information. Social media can influence consumers' purchases decisions through reviews, <clears throat> marketing tactics and advertising no essentially social media vastly impacts our ability to communicate from relationships access and spread of information and to arrive at the best decisions <clears throat> now uh Perhaps no as what we discussed earlier no the most influential social media tool is social networking sites so which is Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Blogger, LinkedIn and Google Plus are the familiar names to the large majority of society no so active social media user or not no almost everyone from the age of before that is age actually 10 no but i think at, as of today even the, at, at the age of Four or five, no, has a Facebook account, no. The social network site can be used to connect people worldwide. So this means that business meetings can be conducted internationally by a Google Hangouts, or old friends can reconnect, no. So for business, for school, for various other groups, the communication possibles are endless. <clears throat> The social media networking sites have increasingly grow beyond personal use. No, recently, employers have begun using social media network site to examine the background of their prospective candidates, as well as to host interview interview via Facebook or other social media technology tools. No, one of the largest industry that social media has had an effect on is a news and journalism. No, since the internet is not the fastest and easiest ways to get news. Print media is diminishing and publishing are big force of the article online. No, so in addition, social media tools have become the new must-have tool in the marketing world. No, digital and internet, uh, in internet marketing are are on the rise. No, and those with no presence on social media will slowly become extinct. No, entrepreneur and small business owner are being to rely on social media sites. To spread the word about their companies, no. So internet marketing at this point is almost synonymous with social media because it is almost guaranteed to reach the largest audience and produce the greatest effects. So the future of the marketing world promises to be shaped by social media, and the possibility are seemingly endless for social media. So it is common for people to go a day without using or referring to social media. So whether it is used for communication, communicating, learning, and decision making, social media is sure to stay and will continue to affect our society. Okay. So 